Wow, it's safe haven again. We're seeing a lot more of this map than I thought we would see. Yes, we're seeing the player to Emmerich again. Yeah, I mean, like, one thing... I think, as well, like, this would be Mr. Cat's choice. And that meant that... Spotius would get to choose the player side, and Spotius prefers player one on this map? Uh, mm -hmm. It's interesting that Mr. Cat actually healed on turn one, so I don't think he can get the turn two thief now. So he actually has to wait till turn three. Actually, maybe Spotius chose uh, to go player A again. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> well, they're both doing. I guess you would like. All right, yeah. Fairly uh, standard openings. Like the thieves are doing their thing. Um, Emmerich's healed, so he's actually going to be able to get an Emmerich crystal up pretty quickly if he just goes for a hit on right. one of these villages. Yeah, yeah. Definitely. He's going to have more pressure than what we saw in the uh, in our the game previously. It looks like Spodius is attempting to punish... Oh. I'm not sure about sitting in the enemy like crit range like that. That seems kind of bad when you don't have um, things that can really damage the knight yet. And there's a mage coming out from behind to heal the knight as well. Like, I, I would probably have chosen to get Groove off the center village instead of the... Um, instead of the bottom one. Mm, I mean, it's not too bad. Like you're... Not too bad, yeah. As long as he doesn't lose too much army here, he can still put his crystal down in front of the HU. Right, I guess the calculation is... Uh, maybe he thinks the dragon... I mean, trading some health on Emmerich for some health on the enemy knight is worth it. Actually, he doesn't even use the crystal this turn. He's just uh, doing more economic damage. But this definitely looks very scary. Emmerich is like down there with like almost nothing protecting him. Yeah. I was going to say he's probably going to wait for his army to come to him before using his crystal. But his army like ran away from him instead. And Emmerich? this witch is going to get blocked off, yeah. How is Emmerich going to escape from this is the question. I mean, you have to go back and heal now, but even if you heal, that doesn't get rid of the army that's just waiting to attack you again next turn. And I think the mage can even crit as well next turn, so that's a lot of damage on the board that can hit Emmerich. So, so I think Mr. Kai is actually kind of like dead. focused... Yeah, Mr. Kai is kind of like focused on just walling off Vesper in the top, but Spodius is focused on killing Emric in the bottom. And I, this is definitely lethal, yeah. Yeah. So, I think... Mr. Kai had a good idea going into the game. Like, I think, yeah, he just should have hit the center village instead of the one below it and had some more anti-air that was available to deal with the dragon. He just kind of left Emmerich out on his own, like you were saying. Mm 